Good morning guys, welcome to today's video. It is 9, 12 a.m. Sam and I are headed out. I did my hair today, straightened it, and already, just from chores, it is frizzy. You know what that means. Another hot day. I'm not gonna lie though, hot days, that pool makes living on a farm and having hot days so much better. Like, that's my thing. Comment below if that's your thing. I could just float around in water outside and be in the sun and get soaked by the sun. It just gives me so much vitamin D. Makes me feel so good. I just love it. Do you love it, Sam? No, oh, I hate the sun. Yeah. The oh, sun's hater. Yeah. <laughs> it is Saturday morning and we're headed out to go yard sailing. It's my other summer thing that I love so much. I love finding things. I like to put out intentions into the universe and tell God what I'm looking to get grain so we gotta stop there too but I love to go out and I love to look for things I tell God what I want and then I just leave it to him and when they appear in my life they appear in my life today I want to find more chicken feeders and more chicken water so hopefully I can find them I don't absolutely need them but I love to have lots of those things because we're always having babies and stuff so that and I don't even know what else I'm gonna let God surprise me this morning I was looking around the farm and I was thinking like this summer, like this spring, spring on the farm is so much fun. And now that everything's calmed down and it's summertime, I was looking around the farm and I was thinking about how this summer, this spring, I put all my intentions, all the things I wanted for our farm, I wanted to get done on our farm, I put them all out there. And I was looking around today and I can't believe all the amazing things that God has brought into our life. Like we have our two pigs, we have a horse for Sophie, we have like our turkeys we have like so many of the things that I said that I wanted we are into registered goats we have three four <coughs> one two three registered goats so many blessings have come into our life I always want to take a minute of every single day and thank God for all the blessings that he's given to us and all the amazing things that he's brought into our life and even for all the adversity because um, of all the lessons that they teach us but anyway I encourage all of you guys to take a minute right now and look around at all the things that you have don't see the things that you don't have just look at it with all the things that you have and all the ways that those things make your life happy and just be so thankful like I am so thankful are you thankful for our life yeah I am so thankful for our life. I love everything about our life. I love the fact that the kids are growing and then they're strong and they're healthy. I love, like there's just so much that I love. But because spring is the busiest time on the farm and the most exciting time on the farm, all of our spring wishes have been met. The only thing that I kind of wish and dream and pray for for the fall is maybe another horse. I think we need another horse. Do you think we need another horse? No. <laughs> Where do you think we need to tell Gabby to get on her horse and just ride him, even if he doesn't want to do what she wants to do? She doesn't, I don't know. I don't know. I feel like there's another horse coming. I haven't seen anything. I haven't dreamt him. Actually, Sophie dreamt it. Sophie dreamt one day that they were outside and a horse trailer pulled in and it was a surprise horse for Gabby. So, and Gabby, for all of you guys who are like, don't force a horse on Gabby. So here's the thing. Gabby is totally open to another horse. She doesn't really want the work of it. She doesn't really want to like clean up after it, but she does dream of another horse. And we talk about it all the time off camera. And she's like, you know, if I get another horse, I'm gonna be so picky, like I'm so picky, you know, like what I want is gonna be really expensive and I, I don't know if she gets a horse this fall or if she gets a horse in five years. I just feel there's another horse in her journey and she talks about it with us all the time. I don't know if you guys have noticed but in every video that we do stuff with the horses and Gabby's in it and Gabby's talking, she's talking about Chino every single time and I always just sit there and listen to her because it still just makes me so sad. I bought Gabby something today that I've been looking for for like the longest time, something she's been dying for. Did you do your chores already? No. She can't even remember. She said, what has she been dying for? I've been dying for chocolate cupcakes. No, the cupcakes are just extra. Here, take the cupcakes off. I bought two things, but it's something you've been really wanting for like a years. But there's two in there. More cupcakes, like <laughs> What's that? Oh, the eclairs. I got just the plain ones and then ones with chocolate on them. Is there more stuff in the car? 
Yeah. yeah. I only know this one because those ones are different. Freezer. Yeah. So this is what she's been wanting. Mm -hmm. All right. I'm going to put them in the freezer because she likes them frozen. Uh -oh. Yet again, I've only mentioned it once. Yeah. She's only mentioned it once, but she really wanted it. We're supposed to get a thunderstorm and it's on its way. But look what I got out of your town. Sam found it for me. You guys know that I've been like working on trying to clean up the property. And there's so many areas that I can't cut my lawnmower. And I have a love-hate relationship with these weed whackers. Like, they drive me crazy. I hate the gas ones. They're always so heavy. And so Sam found me an electric one. The only time I've ever, like, had a okay time with a weed whacker is when I had an electric one a long, long time ago. They don't, I don't find they last very long, but I'm excited. I'm going to use this to clean up the front of the house. I'm going to show you guys a little bit later. But I want to show you what else we found. Sam got me some new filters for the pool, but we found this. Do you guys know what it is? It is one of those pet pools. Let's see if I can put it up. So it's pretty tiny, but I think it's perfect. It's one of those ones that you can use for your pets or your kids, but it's kind of like rubber on the inside and then kind of like a, not a hard wall on the outside, but... Sam and I wanted to get like a pool that the horses could paw in or put their faces in to cool down. So we we're super excited to find that. I found these little books for my brand new baby granddaughter. I love these kind of books because you can sit with them and go through all the animals and teach them. And then this is one of my favorite series and I actually bought her one of these books already. This is the Little Blue Truck Springtime, but these are the Little Blue Truck books are honestly good for boys and girls but it's such a fun series like i love those books then i got two new curtain panels and yeah they're brown whatever who cares they're gonna go in my pool house so that we can get changed in there without having to worry they were only a dollar each i also got this little bag of flowers because i want to use them like for my little wreaths that i have he's literally already having fun with it <laughs> Ellie's like, let's go, Ellie, I got a pool for you. Sam always puts a bucket of water out so that if the dogs get hot and they can't find water, then they have a spot. What happened? Okay. Oh, they, I might have not latched it properly. Okay. Are they doing okay? Yeah, yeah. I closed that door in there. So. Oh, <laughs> Ellie, Ellie, Ellie. Okay, well, not when Ellie's in here. All right, well, let's leave them out, Ellie. Let's leave them out, but you got to give them all fresh water. Hi, turkey. Look at that duck. That's a special color for sure. I think we should make him the, the dad. Here, close the door. I mean, I don't know if it's a boy, but I think it's a boy. Isn't it adorable? Ellie. Wow. I think it's a boy, but he is adorable. And then we have the other ducks over on that side. Sylvie, he's a special color. We should, like use him for the dad even though we could maybe i don't know i love them and then these are our turkeys you guys i really like those two over there i know they're plain though like that one's a special color i have to look that up and see what color it is it's gorgeous so basically the chicken the ducks and the turkeys broke free and everybody's handling it together no problem in here well, you know what we should They're do? They're excited running around. They're like We're zooming. being chased by chickens. We could put them all in here for the daytime, open that, and we could actually open that so they can go out on that no, side. No, because how are we going to get them back through there? Yeah, that's We're not true. Doing that. Anyway, they broke free. I don't know how it happened. Yeah, let's put them in that area. It is uh, literally scorching out here. Whew, it is hot, man. It is definitely going to be a swimming day. Oh my gosh, what is the temperature? The hot tub. You want to swim with me, Ellie? She's like, I want to swim. Come on. The pool's still only 88 degrees. I can feel my hair puffing up as I as I move. Like, I can just feel it puffing up. You guys, it's like an oven. Oh, it's a breeze in here. Posey, come see what I got. You'll like it too. Come on. I had it all set up nicely, and then Posey wrecked it. Woo! <laughs> she can for sure get in. 
It's tiny. I think it's just for dogs. <laughs> she can get in and she loves it. <laughs> Somebody claimed the pool already. <sighs> oh no. <laughs> I love a pet that loves water. <laughs> She loves it. My posy pig is a swimming pig. What do you think? So it was a toss up. Should we put it where the horses want it? Or should we put it for the pigs? She's just rubbing her butt. <laughs> she is so happy. You're so happy. You love it. <laughs> she is like she knew what it was before I even, she's scratching her butt. <laughs> Hopefully that's what she's doing because I don't know about pigs. Oh, oh my gosh. <laughs> You're so happy. But Posy Pig loves herself a big, a nice piggy pool. <laughs> she loves it. Well, we're gonna run out of water this summer. <laughs> I can see how a lot of the water is going to get pouring out because she's just going to tip it to climb in. This pool is for you too, Ellie Bear. This is for you. I don't think I should fill the whole thing because once they push the side down, it's going to come out. So I think that's good. I'm going to fill Posey's water bucket. There you go, Posey Pig. She's covered in mud now. Yeah, she's just scratching. Out of all the pools that I've ever had for like my kids or for the pets or anything, this is the nicest pool. I love it. I've seen them so many times online, but it's just so easy to manage. Like you can, there's a drain for the water, but you can just push the sides over. Like it's perfect. And it's made of like, it's made of really sturdy material. Posey, you're going to have to swim again. Well, hello. <laughs> Everybody hears me. Hi, baby. <laughs> I just love watching them together. I think Posey's second favorite person in the whole world is Ellie. Got him? Yeah. Look, we, oh, where's your fly mask? Is that it? Okay. Cool. Look. <laughs> Let's see, do you like water? She's like, come on, everybody. <laughs> she doesn't know. Is there a storm? We gotta put fly mask on. Storm loves a pool. He actually loves water. He just doesn't like rain. Oh, and there's Penny. He likes water when he goes in it in his own free will. Yeah. Oh, Penny's like, what's that? It's new. It is hot. Like... Sweat when you walk hot. The horses don't have fly masks on. Oh, so there's a method to his madness. It's gonna rain, so he didn't put it on. The pig, so far the pig and storm. Love it. Put your head under there, Gracie, and all those flies will fly off you. This is not like a water trough. This is for swimming. This is for getting cool. Get in there. Just wait, she might get in. You can get bigger ones. This one, this, this one's cheap. And you can get them on Temu. I think she likes 
I think she likes it too. Alright, let's get fly masks on. Come on, big guys! Come on, Storm! I'd love to see her lay down. She could. Somebody likes it. Oh, Gracie's like, be safe, baby. Don't rip a hole in the bottom. Oh, today is the day that we're changing things around. Where'd Penny go? So that the horses are gonna stay out all night, 24 hours, but we're gonna lock them in a certain area so that they're not out eating grass all the time. It looks so cute. That was funny. She just Wait, she rolls in it. She's claimed it. It's hers. <laughs> it's hers. Don't you know that you're beautiful?